Woo, I'm already worn out, but we got, we got some great fights coming up. This is Fight 16. Y'all going to want to get some of this, I'm telling you. This is going to be an awesome, awesome fight. We only getting better at XFC. Here we go. Fight 66, fight 16, a professional catchweight fight. Out of the blue corner, from the Fight Academy, Sebastian Tomasi. Give it up. Oh, His that's my song too. His judo credentials are out of control. Right? His judo credentials are out of control. Yeah. Woo -wee! Give it up. Sebastian Tomesi! Sebastian is a 10-time Australian judo champion, so we know he's trying to end the fight by using the earth as his weapon. But Craig Callahan was oh, oh. standing across from him, and he is... Mansfield! We are going to keep... When it comes to grappling himself. Mansfield! That's right, man. I'm looking forward to this. What? Michael's right, man. Let me get better. Sebastian Tomasi! All right, coming out of the red corner from Integrated Martial Arts, Craig Callahan! Pros to jump in here. These will be five minute rounds. We got five by solo. three minute rounds. Let's go. All right, so here we go into our first pro fight for the night. from Tomesi. Oh, Craig straight back with a good left hand. Nice, nice left cross right through. I felt like Chris, uh, Craig kind of slipped there a bit, but uh, not taking anything away from Sebastian at all. At this stage, they're just feeling each other out. This oh. is an excellent matchup. Excellent. Certainly is. This member Sebastian is highly ranked in judo. So if he gets a hold of Craig and uh, clasps his hands together, he's going for a ride. Craig has some excellent grappling skills, though. He's really good on the ground. I cornered someone against him one time. It didn't last that long. You didn't get to see very much. 
but nonetheless, we got through it. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, clinching up. Oh, comes leaping left. Look. Really, really good there. So as he's, as he's retreating, he's still throwing punches. That's a good lesson for the amateurs that no matter what happens, you throw punches going in and going out. Sebastian, seem, he doesn't seem super fast, but really good timing. Oh, left hand again by Craig, though. Craig's finding a place for that left hand. Craig's got a little bit of a mouse on his left eye. He certainly has. What are you looking at here, Michael? What do you reckon is happening here? I, I don't think that um, Craig's faced somebody like this. He seems to have a good stand-up. He's not really scared of Craig's ground game. So I think Craig has to really dig deep and think what Ooh, arsenal he has to be in. Yeah, certainly. And there's Ryan some nice strikes here as well. This will be the most tested I think Craig has been so far in his, in his career. In terms of going to the well and bringing out all the different skill sets, I, I agree with you, mate. That's the thing that I mentioned before the judo, but once you go against an integrated boy, they, they don't stay on the ground for very long. No, they don't. Both well coached. Beautiful composure. Craig has a really good resilience, and he also and has a big knee to the body for Sebastian. Sorry, Michael, what are you saying? Craig's stamina is, is next level. So that's not gonna oh, be big kick to the liver. That was strong. You can hear it. Sebastian answers with the one, two, and Craig says, I'll do the same. Craig just needs to keep sitting down on his punches. Every time he does that, he drives him back. Every time. It's just the one, two. Nice little question mark kick there. Just changing things up a little bit, making people think. I think Craig's starting to think about taking the takedown. Now he's starting to look at his torso, starting to set some things up. Uh, he, I, I can see his eyes wandering a little bit down there. But Sebastian has his uh, lead hand down nice and low, which kind of makes, uh, makes the takedown a bit harder because you can sprawl easier. The five minute rounds make a big difference. You've got to think this is only just longer than a no, like the amateur rounds right now. There's still a minute and a half left in this round. And anything can happen in three minutes. Yeah. It's when you get to the fourth and fifth minute, that's when things change. Oh, dramatically. big shots from both boys in the middle there. Both sitting right in the pocket. These guys are going at it so much, so much technical. Problems. Oh, big <laughs> left hand by Callahan. Oh, oh my goodness, straight left. It was like overhand and straight. Well timed, well placed. Sebastian doesn't look too phased though. Sebastian's coming back with his own shots, just like that. Craig needs to start checking those, those kicks. He's eating them up right now. Nice now over the, again. That coming right under the elbow twice now. Really good kick by Callahan. The crowd is loving this. Oh, another big left. At the Mansfield Tavern, XFC 46. And right now, Sebastian's cut up above the eye. Sebastian looks like he's fading a bit now, and Callahan's starting to pour it on. Oh, he's coming back just as he said it. that. Come and take his curse. Next, next 10 seconds left. I will, I will, I'll blow that up. And these guys are li licking in the habit. In stages for both of them. If I was a judge, probably just take it out to Callahan, maybe. But that very, was very brutal. Even round. That was brutal for both fighters. Very even round. And that's where you see the difference between amateurs and professionals. These guys are lighting it up. Great technique, beautiful work. All right, so right here, what we've got here is both the guys, both the teams are getting their instructions. That's the last thing we need. They're both getting their instructions from their coaches. Oh, the doctor's in having a look at the cut. Surely that cut's not enough to stop this fight just yet. No, no, doctor's had a look, he's happy with it. 
Oh, we love to see that. I hate when doctors come in, they take a real good look yeah. and thinking, oh my gosh, they're going to stop it. And that can play with your mind. Adrian just mentioned to Craig as well. It's mind games now. Yep. Every minute that goes by, that's something that can mess with your mind. Both boys looking in tremendous shape too. Keeping a really good pace going for that whole first five. They're big boys too. Ooh. I love this division. This is only welterweight too, isn't it? They're very big. The difference between the pros, man. They've got Whoa! Ooh. Left cross hook. The biggest difference I'm seeing right now is that straight left from Craig is actually straight, and he's just catching him with a longer punch. Yeah. It makes it difficult, the southpaw stance as well. But at this point here, looks like the judo, he might be going for a ride. He's lacing the leg well. He but is a really good grappler in his own right, though. Yeah. And Sebastian's give, changing him different looks as well. Really testing out the strength of the cage. Looks like that eye's opened up a bit more. You can see a bit more blood. It's oh, it's now. streaming. It's pouring out. Craig's calling for it. I'm, I'm backing up. <laughs> <laughs> nice little front kick there. Just to keep the distance. Oh, I think Sebastian knows that eye's in trouble. He's trying to do something about it, but it's hard to do in the middle of a fight. And yeah, the factor yeah. is that that'll close up over time, too. This is a five-round fight. Yeah, but you don't want to wipe it because that wipes all the seat. Oh, big left hand. That, that left is finding a home. Oh, so close. That knee almost found a home with Craig's head on it. All right, nice little inside leg kick. What I'm liking is Sebastian is changing the distances and sizes. Like diff different movements, different techniques, giving Craig different things to think about. But this, is is this is actually Craig's world. He loves, he loves the long drawn out fights. Yeah. But Craig is honed in on above that left eye. That's what he's looking for. Yep. Oh, again. <laughs> Sebastian needs to throw more than that one punch because he's going one, Craig's going three and four. I'll tell you, these fighters are some tough, tough fighters. They're taking everything and keep coming forward. I just, I just love how Sebastian's mixing it up and throwing different techniques in there as well. Craig's pretty honed in on that rally though. Ooh. This is a good example of what I'm talking about, the ones and twos and the Craig's four, five, sixes, right? Yep. yep. Th throw, your throw your punches and punches. Oh! oh. That's three to the liver so far he's taken for this fight. Oh! He can't take too many more of those. No, they're breathing him in now. They got the deep breaths in this one here. Ah, oh, he's hunting him down. He's hunting him down. Has he stopped it? All right, looks like he rest He it. hasn't waved it off yet, so has he waved it off or just is he getting the doctor to look at it? Did he wave it off? Yeah, he waved he it off. It. Not calling for the doctor. You can't just point at someone and then the fight's gonna get stuck. Yeah, it off. Oh, he's hunting him down. Fight number 16 by referee stoppage TKO. Your winner in the red corner from Integrated Martial Arts, Craig Callahan.
What's up, brother? How are you, man? I'm much better than I'm not fighting you. <laughs> That's been a while ago. I'm telling you, man, but I'm telling you, I've seen nothing but improvements. Uh, not only your grappling game is, is, is renowned, but your stand-up and how you stuck with it, your ones and twos. What was your game plan coming into the first round? Man, I know he's a, a judo black belt, 10-time Australian judo champ. Had to be careful if I closed the distance, but I thought I'd have the advantage striking, doing a sh shit ton of work out of Nitro Box with Blair Studley and a shit ton of work out of Integrated with Adrian working on my striking every week. I'll tell you a lot of good stuff coming out of, head, out, out of, uh, out of uh, Integrated and Blair Studley, especially with, hard, with uh, the um, head splitter yeah. and doing what he's doing. That's amazing. And now you're just adding on top of it. Everybody, give a big hand and applause to Craig Callahan. I was thinking, are you ever going to get a nickname? Uh, maybe. We'll see. And I love that jump around song. It brings me out, baby. Give it up, Craig Callahan. Hold the hands up so you see you're in a good grip.